Trevor, the CEO of the same foundation. The donation we received from Intubates helped us in procuring vital life-saving medical equipment and PPE for Tigerberg and Huitzkia hospitals in the Western Cape. Um, this was while the Western Cape was the epicenter of the pandemic. If you would like to get in touch or assist us in these projects, you can get hold of us on our website, which is www.samefoundation.org.za, Facebook and Instagram or LinkedIn. Next up will be race number four, and race number four will be run at 14.25. They'll be going around a couple of turns because over 1,950, so they jump on the turn. They'll then go into the back stretch, which is about 700 meters of straight strip, into the next turn and around about the 1,000 meter mark, and the next turn will be for home with about 600 meters to go. So race number four gonna be quite exciting. Gallup TV 75 handicap, and I say quite exciting because the betting will tell the story. Once again, one of those races that is very wide open. Number one, Duchess of Gold is your seven to two favorite. Number seven, Jollification, nine to two. Number eight, Lily Bell, five to one, with number three, Khan Judy, five to one. Number nine, Escapologist is at six to one, and Yezo Hosu absolutely loves the turf and also loves the course, Escapologist, and then we have Ballroom Bliss at seven to one. Warren, when you look at race number four, for me this has field written all over it because I've gone through the runners and you can make a case for just about each and every runner in the field. On their best form, they could quite simply win this race and there's nothing that can really put you off any of them. The second race and the fourth race were the two races where I thought, Poof, we need crystal balls and more. But in saying that, uh, you know, we'll talk about one or two horses. But yes, the field, if we can, af if, if we can afford the field, uh, I would suggest the field because it certainly is that type of, field, uh, type of race. And as you've just alluded to the betting, that tells the story. But number four, Ballroom Bliss, is an interesting runner for me. Uh, she's a six-year-old mare. She hasn't won for 239 days. I'm aware of all that. She gets Kabedi James de Harbour, who will knock some weight off. That'll help. Cozily drawn. She's only had two starts in the province and we've spoken to Baron Botus on many occasions and he said he's just taken some time to settle in, to get to know the tracks, to get to know the environment, etc. But he has a horse that has had two starts in the province, uh, both over 1600 metres. Um, the, the first start in the province wasn't great, valid excuses. The last run, which was on the poly, uh, fifth three and a half lengths to Mauritania. Uh, I just think that she'll be a lot sharper and, and, and she could be you know, worth a mention and, and, and maybe an each way selection in a race where we're suggesting to go to the field. Duchess of Gold certainly obviously got a chance. I see Germain Maharaj is tipping the stable companion, a kind Judy, who too would be no shocks uh, found in the winner's box. So difficult. I don't want to go on and on and on, but a uh, field for, for the exotics. Um, roving banker, ballroom bliss for me. Well, that's my first selection, number four, Ballroom Bliss. The case that she was 100 at one stage in the merit rating, she was rated 100, she's down to a 77. And number three, Kind Judy, that'll be my second selection. So you mentioned the Baron Buerta's horses, just needed the one or two horse, horse runs in the KwaZulu Natal region. And Ballroom Bliss, after running 3.6 lengths behind Mauritania, had that run at Scottsdale in the penultimate run, and trading at seven to one, Racing off a 77, so drop two points from the last run and gets a kilo and a half off the back. So whilst we say the field, number four, Ballroom Bliss, will be an each way bet and a horse worth throwing into the exactors. Along with number three, Khan Judy, who's had the one run in a merit rated 86, an 80 in the prior race and a seven time winner. So it could be a Ballroom Bliss exactor, but there's a few others who certainly have a chance. So although it's a field race, if you put us in a corner, Number four, Ballroom Bliss at seven to one. If she can bring anything near her best merit rating, she'll go very close here. My name is Beston. I live in Cape Town. Also, I do uh, delivery. Interbet helped me to realize my dreams. Now I have my own delivery vehicle and I'm able to do the removal in in the round Cape Town.